Hello friends, today I'm going to solve little problem number 151, reverse words in a string. In this problem, we are given an input string S and we got to reverse the order of the words. And this input string S can contain um, uh, any word or it can contain extra spaces before or after it or between the words. Okay, so while we are reversing the string, we need to remove any extra spaces that is present in the string. Okay, so in this example, if you look at this string, we have extra spaces before this um, string and after the end of the string, right? So in the output, we got to remove the extra spaces. So here the string is a space, an empty space, hello world and empty space, right? But the output is world hello. And we are separating each word by space. Similarly, here we have extra spaces, but in our output, the extra space is removed. Okay, so that is what we need to take care. Now, how are we going to solve this problem? Um, let's look at the constraint first. So the length of string is at least one and it cons consists of English letters can be uppercase or lowercase digits and spaces. And there is at least one word in S okay if the string data type is mutable in your language can you solve it in um, in place with O of one extra space okay but string data type in JavaScript is not mutable as uh, I, I can show you an example of string data type not being mutable but yeah let's see how first how we can solve this problem so first of all we have words right so basically from this string we need to get each of the word so that we can reverse each of the words right so we have to first of all use the split um, function in javascript which would give us an array of words in our string. So while we have the array of words, now what we can do is we can reverse the array of words either by using the reverse function or by uh, just manually uh, looping over each of the elements and reversing each of the words, okay? Uh, but the thing is, how do we deal with the extra spaces? So the extra spaces before and after can be removed by using the trim function, which is available in JavaScript. But what about the space in between? Like if there are multiple spaces, then we will get a word which is an empty string, an empty string word. So we should remove that, right? So for that, we are going to use filter and that is how we can solve this problem but let me first uh, instead of using all the javascript functions let me just first solve this problem without using any of the functions so that you are able to understand it properly so we still need each of the words from this string so that we can reverse the words so we are going to use the split function and that will give us an array of words okay i'm just going to write words equals as that split and we are going to split it over space right this gives us now word we can like um, I'll just console console log each of uh, these words so that you can see you can see what each of these words are now since we have each of the word we want to reverse it and create a new string right so I'm just going to create a new string which is our result equals an empty string and now we are going to iterate over each of the word in our uh, words list right starting from the end so i equals to words that length minus one i is less um, i is greater than equals to zero i minus minus so we are doing from end to first so that we can reverse it and here we are going to check if word um words uh dot length equals zero that is if it is an empty string then we are just going to continue continue else if there is a word then we are going to add it to our result else um what are we going to do is result plus equals uh, word and index i okay now one more thing is here 
we are only concatenating each of the word but we also need to add spaces uh, after each word and be between the words right so um, I have been adding here one extra space here but what about at the end at the end we will uh, end up with one extra space right so we for that we can either use trim or what I'm just going to do here is I'm just going to use one more if condition so that is if um result length equals zero that is if that's the first word then i'm just going to concatenate the result the word to the result else it is not the first word if that is not the first word that means there is one word before and then we have the next word so be after, before adding the next word we want a space right so what are we going to do is i'm just going to copy paste it over here i'm going to add a space and then the next word so this will basically add spaces between the words okay and now finally we are going to return result so let's now try to run this code and check if this works okay um word hello and i got an extra space after this place okay so yeah one more thing here as you can see we are getting some extra empty uh uh empty strings right okay so thing the thing that i did wrong is i need to check the length of index i if that's equals to zero the word at that index is equals to zero. all right now i got the correct answer so this is how we can solve it and it would result in o of n time complexity as split operation takes o of n time complexity as well as we have one for loop which should take o of n time complexity let's try to submit this so this solution is o of n time complexity and uh, the space complexity is also o of n now let's solve it using javascript uh, 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 functions okay so that will be very less um, time spaces that will very less line of code so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to return so first of all the string as we are going to use the trim operation that would basically trim any empty spaces um empty string before i mean any spaces before and after the string and then i'm going to use the split operation to split the string next what i'm going to do is i'm going to use filter operation so this FILT filter operation is used to basically remove any string which is empty so um, any word so w w so this will just do the this much of the code will just do its work right and now after filtering after we have each of the word what are we going to do is we are just going to use join operation to join each of the word with a space in between and then finally okay before joining we got to reverse each of the word right each of the word in our split it string our array so for that i'm going to use reverse function and then join the reversed words all right so that's it now let's try to run our code and check if that works awesome so that's so simple it looks so clean and so concise right and the time complexity is still o of n in this case because trim operation is also of n time complexity split is also of n filter also takes o of n time complexity reverse is also of n and join function is also o of n time complexity so yeah it's o of n time complexity overall so i hope you liked my solution let me know in the comments down below and thank you so much for watching till the end Thank you.